Hi guys. Um, today has been incredibly stressful. I ordered a package on Tuesday, expecting it to come Wednesday. I have then been in Thursday, Friday, and I've waited all day today, and it has only just arrived. I have been on the phone to DPD constantly. I have been texting them, emailing them, messaging them on the app. And finally, my app has arrived, and the reason I am rushing through this is because I need to get this um, opened and shown, and then package up some orders, because obviously everyone's been waiting since Thursday. So, I am quickly doing an unboxing here, and then I'm going straight to the post office, and sending out some lovely lip sense orders, and other pack orders to some lovely customers. So without further ado, um, and apologies for the lack of enthusiasm, but I am really excited to show you these. Um, so here are some of the products that I've got this week. Oh, that's a bit bright with the sun. Um, okay, everyone's been loving matte gloss recently. I always loved glossy gloss. Is, am I okay with the lighting or do I need to come inside a bit? Is that better? Yeah. Um, I am in love with glossy gloss, which is... Obviously, it has a glossy gloss finish. Oh, and by the way, before anyone asks, I'm wearing B Ruby today, which is this colour here. I haven't worn it for a while. I'm about to post a picture to Instagram, um, which if you don't follow me over there, you should, because I post all the time over there. Um, but yeah, I love glossy gloss. I'm also a fan of Diamond Kiss Gloss, which is this sparkly one. And I'm also a fan of the newly released limited edition. Are we still recording? And I'm also a fan of the newly released limited edition prism gloss, which is absolutely gorgeous. And it almost leaves um, like a fluorescent finish over the lip. I am going to go live and show the difference between glossy gloss matte and, and prism gloss at some point. Hopefully this week, because this video was supposed to be last week's video, so that was this week's video. So I might do two this week and treat you all. But anyway, all my customers have been loving matte gloss recently. Um... I don't mind matte gloss, if you don't like a glossy gloss finish, matte gloss is the gloss for you. But, personally, I prefer a glossy finish and I also find that it's more moisturising. But a lot of people love matte gloss and you can also um, go between the two. So, if you want another gloss in your life, matte gloss is the next one. I've then got some gorgeous lip colours and some shadow scents. So, for myself, I've got a new candlelight and a mocha java shimmer. So, candlelight's on the bottom, that's the one I use for concealer and for... Um, as a base for my eye makeup and then Mocha Java Shimmer is just a gorgeous shimmery colour and it's perfect for um, transitioning so when you tra transition between two colours it's the perfect like it caught crease corner and that's what I'm going to be using it for I've then got some colours for some customers and everyone's been loving nude recently nude is a colour that I've never really been fond of I've tried it once when I did my um, 50 colour pictures and I've never worn it since I, don't I didn't like, particularly like it on me, but everyone's been loving it recently, um, and so I've got a few of them. And then one customer ordered Dawn Rising, and no one's ordered Dawn Rising before, so I'm interested to see what she thinks of it. I actually really like Dawn Rising, and when I tried it on, I was torn between whether to buy myself a Dawn Rising or a Nutmeg, and I ended up going for a Nutmeg, which is this colour on the left, and Dawn Rising is the one on the right. So Dawn Rising and Nutmeg are very similar colours, but Nutmeg has a slight shimmery finish to it. Dawn Rising is a, not a shimmery, so that's the difference between the two. But my customer ended up going for Dawn Rising, which is fair enough. Not everyone likes the glittery shimmery finish. I'm all for glitter, but these are going straight for her and they should be posted within the next 15 minutes. Post office is just out on the road. My mum's having a wedding in June. No, she's not. In August. And so I bought her, well, I'm doing her makeup and I've, she's bought loads of makeup off me. She's bought, um, medium colour correcting tint to moisturiser because she doesn't have like blemishes that she particularly needs to cover up and she's got like gorgeous skin anyway she's just shit but so it'll just make it a little bit more flawless and um, she's bought she's going to borrow my lip scents I think she's going to go for pink champagne I'm trying to convince her to go for pink champagne and I'm trying to convince her to go for rose gold shimmer on her eyes so fingers crossed she goes for those two um we've lost internet connection again are we back we're back um and she's bought dark, uh, medium concealer, which is perfect for her eyes. And then she's bought dark circle eye treatment because she's been complaining about her dark circles. So she's bought dark circle eye treatment to treat them. And then eye illuminator, which is our amazing eye cream with Cineplex Complex in, so our anti-aging formula, and our pearlizer mixed together. So that's perfect for going under your makeup. 
So I thought I'd treat her to this because she's bought so much. Um, I do treat my customers not only if they're my mum, but it, as soon as you spend a certain amount, I treat you. Um, and I bought her terracotta blush shirts. I used Pink Posy Shadow Spencer's blush shirts of the day when we did the trial makeover. But I think this one will be the one for her because she's quite young. I've then gone oops because um, mine has a slight fault. So I've got a replacement for oops. I've got a replacement for lash scents. Because again, um, last time I had the wrong shade. So they swatched switched that out for me which is perfect so it's now black instead of brown uh, a few people do like brown but all my customers tend to go for black which is fine because I only wear black and then I've also got some glossy gloss samples I'm going to be doing a post recently not no I'm not I'm going to do a post soon and um, so if anyone hasn't yet ordered from me I will be doing a post offering free beauty books and glossy gloss samples with an applicator um, and that's for anyone who's interested in the product uh, products so it'll give you a little trial of how amazing our glossy gloss is. Um, it goes, it's got shea butter and vitamin E, so it's super hydrating and super moisturising. Um, and it really is an incredible product. Um, but also you can see the book, beauty book and see all the products that we've got available at the moment. Um, anyway. Oh, no, I forgot. I've also got um, a 3-in-1 cleanser. So I've been using a mixture of a 3-in-1 um, normal to oily, and I've also been using the oily to acne. The oily to acne just finished. I've used two of those and I've used one of these. I'm now going to this one, so I tend to take it in turns. But I've also now um, changed my skincare routine a little bit because I've been prescribed some medication from the doctor to sell my antibiotics and a cream for my acne. Um, and I don't want to dry out too much, so I'm going to go for this one. Okay, I've finished. I'm going to be going live again some point soon comparing the glasses and I'm also going to be going live about the giveaway. But if you haven't seen my last Instagram post, which I do share here as well, um, but if you haven't seen that post, it's got all the giveaway instructions on it. And don't forget to add yourself to my Facebook group to get entered into it more times. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll speak to you next time. Bye.